Hello, my name is Jill Bauer. I'm an ESL instructor at North Seattle College. This video is an introduction to nonverbal communication. Nonverbal communication is what we do with our face, eyes, body, and voice when we communicate. This is why some people call nonverbal communication body language. Nonverbal communication is not about what we say, but how we say it. Here is a very common example. If someone asks me a yes-no question, I can answer without saying a word. I can nod my head to say yes, or I can shake my head to say no. Here are four areas of nonverbal communication. Facial expressions, eye contact, gestures, and personal space. First, facial expressions are the ways we move our face when we are talking and listening. The most common facial expression is a smile. However, facial expressions can also be negative. For example, if someone furrows their brow, it means that they move their eyebrows closer together like this. This could mean that someone is confused, worried, or maybe just thinking. Second, eye contact is a very important type of nonverbal communication. Eye contact means to look at another person in the eyes. If I do not make eye contact, I might look down or to the side. Third, gestures. Another important area is gestures. Gestures are body or hand movements. For example, if someone asks me a question, I might say, I don't know like this. I don't know. I move my shoulders and my hands like this. This is, an, this is an example of a gesture. Some people gesture a lot when they talk. We say they talk with their hands. Fourth, personal space. Personal space is the amount of room between two people. I can stand very close to a person or very far away from a person. Personal space changes from culture to culture. It also changes from person to person. Some people need a lot of personal space. These people will be uncomfortable if you stand very close to them. There are other types of nonverbal communication, such as voice and touch. Remember, Nonverbal communication is any way that we communicate with our face, eyes, body, and voice. Thank you.